On the face of it, the tiny village of Salinas in the Barona province of the southwestern region of the Dominican Republic is similar to most other Caribbean gateways. The locals are welcoming, there are exotic beaches and the sun beats down frequently, however, there is one uniqueness that sets it aside from the rest of the world. At puberty one in 1990 kids born the make a natural change from girl to boy often known as the gvidosis, which that actually translates as penis at 12 dash these kids are known in medical terms as pseudohermaphrodite. The gvidosis were discovered in 1970 by Cornell University endocrinologist Dr. Julian Imperato, who traveled to the area to find out more about rumors that girls were morphing into boys. And in the 40 years since there have been researches, more has been found out about the flawlessly natural condition thought to have come about through a rare genetic illness. The disorder is brought about by a lacking enzyme, which hinders the generation the male sex hormone, dihydrotestosterone, in the womb, and produces what resembles a baby girl on birth. It isn't until puberty when testosterone flows, their voices break and they develop a male sexual reproductive organ that they turn out to be accepted as male. Gvidoses are as well at times referred to as mechahembras, which means first a woman, then a man. When they are born they resemble girls with no testicles and what seems to be a vagina. It is just when they near puberty that the penis develops and testicles go down. When Dr. Imperato probed the Gvidoses she found out that the reason they do not have male genitalia at birth is due to the fact that they are lacking in an enzyme known as 5-reductase that usually transforms testosterone into dihydrotestosterone.